As Alfred Stieglitz and others developed photography as a fine art medium, a group of local photographers were experimenting with their equipment throughout Lancaster. In May 1895, the Lancaster Camera Club was organized. Among its founding officers was Charles DeMuth's father, Ferdinand DeMuth, who served as secretary and treasurer for the group. Their meeting place was on Penn Square, a few blocks west from the family home. Ferdinand began exploring photography in the 1890s while in his mid-30s and produced both photographic prints as well as lantern slides. Photography was a hobby for him, as his main occupation was the family business of running the DeMuth Tobacco Shop and Cigar Manufactory with his father and brother. When Ferdinand died in 1911, his obituary said he was one of the first in this city to pursue the amateur study of photography and had valuable collection of views he had taken. Like his peers in the Lancaster Camera Club, Ferdinand's views consisted of a variety of subjects, both rural and urban, documenting everyday life in Lancaster. He created personal portraits, like images of the family enjoying their backyard and working in the tobacco shop. Ferdinand also captured his community, documenting big events like the circus coming to town, city life as seen from the steeple of Holy Trinity Lutheran Church next door from his home, and the idyllic Conestoga River winding through the countryside. Ferdinand was a pioneer of photography in Lancaster. He and others created a time capsule of imagery for future generations to understand our community's landscape and residents' lives at the turn of the 20th century.